Grab the eBook 2024. The main objective of an airport operational database, AODB, is to provide a single centralized store of airport operation data for use by internal and external business partners to the airport operator. The AODB provides standard connections for all users to send and receive data and represents a primary integration platform in the airport environment. Other features of an AODB typically include operational data replication, global data dictionary, data distribution, store and forward capabilities, data security and archiving. The operational systems integrated into the AODB typically include the Flight Information Display System, FIDs, Baggage Handling System, BHS, Building Management System, BMS, Telephone Systems, and the Security System. The internal airport users of the AODB may be non-operationally critical airport systems, such as the Financial Systems and Maintenance Management Systems. Examples of external users are airlines, cargo handlers, and government agencies such as customs and immigration. An airport operational database, AODB, is a key component of airport operations, providing real-time access to critical information related to airport operations. The components of an AODB typically include Airport data this component of an AODB includes data related to the physical infrastructure of the airport, such as runways, taxiways, parking areas, and terminals. This data also includes information related to the location and status of airport equipment and vehicles. Flight data. The flight data component of an AODB includes information about scheduled and actual flights, such as departure and arrival times, gate assignments, aircraft types, and passenger information. Resource Management This component of an AODB includes information related to airport resources, such as staff scheduling, equipment allocation, and service availability. Airline Communication The airline communication component of an AODB includes messaging and communication between the airport and airlines, such as flight updates, gate changes, and baggage handling information. Operational Analytics This component of an AODB includes tools for analyzing airport operations data to identify trends, monitor key performance indicators, and support decision-making. Security and Safety The security and safety component of an AODB includes information related to airport security and safety, such as passenger screening, access control, and emergency response planning. Integration with other systems The AODB needs to integrate with other airport systems such as flight information displays, baggage handling systems, and other operational systems to provide real-time updates. The components may vary depending on the specific needs and requirements of the airport. Engineering An airport operational database, AODB, is a crucial component in the airport's overall IT infrastructure, providing a centralized system to manage critical information related to the airport's operations. Some of the essential engineering parameters for an AODB include Scalability. The AODB should be scalable to accommodate growth in airport traffic, airline operations, and other system integrations. Availability. The AODB must be available 24-7 to support airport operations without downtime or disruption. Reliability. The AODB should be reliable, ensuring that airport staff can rely on the data and information presented by the system. Security. The AODB must have robust security measures to protect sensitive information, prevent unauthorized access, and mitigate the risk of cyber attacks. Integration. 
the AODB should integrate with other airport systems, such as flight information displays, baggage handling systems, and air traffic control systems. Data accuracy. The AODB should ensure that data is accurate, timely, and relevant to airport operations. Usability. The AODB should have an intuitive user interface, making it easy for airport staff to use and access the information they need quickly. Flexibility. The AODB should be flexible enough to accommodate changes in airport operations, airline schedules, and other factors that may impact airport operations. Performance. The AODB must perform well with fast response times and low latency to ensure that airport staff can access the information they need in real time. Maintenance. The AODB must be easy to maintain with robust monitoring tools to identify and resolve any issues that may arise. Cost Benefits Implementing an Airport Operational Database AODB, can provide several cost benefits to an airport. Some of the significant cost benefits of an AODB include Increased efficiency. An AODB can help streamline airport operations, reducing the time and resources required to manage various processes. This increased efficiency can result in cost savings through reduced staffing requirements and improved resource utilization. Reduced downtime. An AODB can help identify potential issues early, reducing the likelihood of downtime due to system failures or operational errors. This can result in cost savings by avoiding costly delays, missed connections, and other disruptions. Improved decision-making. An AODB can provide real-time data and insights into airport operations, enabling airport staff to make better informed decisions. This can result in cost savings by reducing the likelihood of operational errors and minimizing the impact of disruptions. Better resource management, an AODB can provide visibility into airport resources, such as gates, runways, and staffing levels. This can help optimize resource allocation, reducing waste and improving utilization. These savings can be significant, as airport resources are often a significant expense. Improved revenue generation and AODB can help improve the passenger experience, leading to increased passenger satisfaction and repeat business. Additionally, better resource management can lead to increased capacity and the ability to handle more flights, resulting in increased revenue. Reduced maintenance costs. An AODB can help identify potential maintenance issues early, reducing the cost of repairs and preventing system downtime. This can result in cost savings through reduced maintenance expenses and increased system reliability. Overall, an AODB can help reduce costs, increase revenue, and improve the overall efficiency and effectiveness of airport operations, these benefits can lead to significant cost savings and increased profitability over the long term. System Integration The integration of an airport operational database, AODB, with other airport systems is critical for effective airport operations. The AODB needs to be able to integrate with various airport systems to provide real-time information and updates. Some of the key systems that an AODB needs to integrate with include Flight Information Display System, FIDS. The FIDS displays flight information to passengers and airport staff. The AODB needs to integrate with the FIDs to provide accurate and real-time flight information. Baggage Handling System The Baggage Handling System BHS, tracks passenger baggage throughout the airport. The AODB needs to integrate with the BHS 
to ensure that baggage is routed to the correct destination. Resource Management Systems Resource management systems are used to schedule airport staff, equipment, and other resources. The AODB needs to integrate with resource management systems to ensure that the correct resources are available for each flight. Gate management systems. Gate management systems are used to manage gate assignments for flights. The AODB needs to integrate with gate management systems to ensure that flights are assigned to the correct gates. Security systems. Security systems such as access control systems and surveillance systems are critical for airport security. The AODB needs to integrate with security systems to ensure that only authorized personnel have access to restricted areas. Passenger check-in system. The AODB system integrates with the passenger check-in system to manage the passenger check-in process. This helps airport staff manage passenger flow, minimize wait times, and ensure that flights depart on time. Air traffic control systems. Air traffic control ATC systems are used to manage air traffic within the airport airspace. The AODB needs to integrate with ATC systems to ensure that flight schedules are aligned with ATC regulations. Ground handling systems. Ground handling systems are used to manage ground operations for aircraft, such as fueling and maintenance. The AODB needs to integrate with ground handling systems to ensure that ground operations are coordinated with flight schedules. The specific systems that need to be integrated may vary depending on the specific needs and requirements of the airport. Thanks for watching. Give us a like and subscribe.